just get our lines updated, and what we're going to do is you're going to download your files from the Google Classroom. To download a file on Google Classroom, you can click on the file. It's going to then try to open on the internet, and all you have to do is click the download button. Boom. So now it's downloading, and it will download to your download folder. Here is your download. You can close this file, and then go back, download your next file. Click on the download, then go back and click on your final file. And now you have downloaded your three Illustrator files. So you can now see your three Illustrator download files here at the bottom of your screen. You can click on or and it will launch Adobe Illustrator. Here is your triangle file, and today we're going to start off with the triangle and the pen tool. So you click on the pen tool, which is the third tool down on the left of the toolbar, mm -hmm. and right now it's going to fill with a white fill and black outline. So you can click on the black outline and change it to a color, so let's go ahead and change it to a color of maybe a blue color, like a blue color. And the fill, you don't want to actually have a fill. You want to make sure that it is empty so that you can actually see where you're drawing. So let's change that to none. You have the pen tool with a blue uh, line and a no fill. And let's set that to about six points so you can see the line. We're going to start with clicking on A and then let go. And you click on B and then let go. And you click on, on C. And if you notice here, um, it has a straight line. So that means that from A to, to actually from B to C, it is a straight line. If you move down, it is no longer a straight line. So go ahead and use this where it's going to tell you where the straight line is going to be from B to C. So now we have a straight line. And then you go back to A. And you close it. You want to make sure that the path is closed. So now you actually have a blue triangle with no fill. You can actually click on the color swaps over here and now it will be a blue fill with no outline. You can go file, save as. What I like to do is I make sure... Oh, go ahead, Neil. What I like to do is go ahead and save it as uh, 01 for the class period. Your last name, my last name is Ramirez. My first initial is S and it's a, a triangle and it's going to be saved as an Illustrator EPS. Now, it's in my downloads folder with the other files. But what I, to make it easier, I'm going to make a folder, and I'm going to call it 01, because this is our first Illustrator assignment, underscore, and lines. So these are all line projects that we're making. So now it's going to save as lines and save and OK. And it's now saving your Illustrator line file as an EPS and close that. Now you can go back to your the internet and choose the next file, which is the squares, and it will then op open up. And what is different with the squares is you're going to go ahead and choose a no fill for the inside and you're going to choose a color for the line. Let's go ahead and make it six points again up here at the top so you have a thick line. And we're going to start off by clicking with the pen tool and you're going to go <coughs> click on A and you hold down the shift key and it'll automatically go to B and make a straight line. You hold down on the shift key, it'll go to C and make a straight line. You go down and you line up the D with the A and now you come back and you close it off with A over here. So now you have a red square. And now we can go ahead and flip the colors, swap fill, and stroke. So now it is a red square with no outline. File save as. Once again, we're going to save it inside the zero one lines folder as our first assignment. Save it as period one or period two or period three, whichever period you are in with your last name and your first initial underscore first initial and you're going to save it as an illustrated DPS save and okay and close it out go back to the internet 
and you can click on your next file, or you can actually click show in folder and it's showing you that this is the file here in your downloads folder you double click and look there's our zero one lines folder that we created earlier this one's a little bit harder this is our star so we're going to actually make let's make it a yellow star uh outline and no fill color and let's make sure that our line is big so we can see it it's 10 point we're clicking on the pen tool again you can click on a then click on d then click on C, then click on D, then click on E, then click on F, then click on G, then H, I, J, and back to A again, which closes our star. Now, what was really important on this one is that we didn't have the fill, so you could actually see where all the letters are and where all your points were. Now, we're going to go ahead and swap the fill and stroke color. So now you're going to have a yellow star with no outlines. You're going to go File, Save As. You're going to save it with 01 for your class period, 2, 3, 4, 5, or 6, whichever your class period is. Your last name, your first initial, and save it as an Illustrator file, EPS. And make sure you save it in the 01 lines, uh, lines file. Here we go, go ahead and save. And now you have a folder that's filled with all three of your files. So here's your downloads folder. Here's our folder. It has all three of our files. We're gonna go back and we're gonna upload our folder to our Google Drive. So you're gonna go over here to your, make a new tab, go, go over here and select on your Google when you're logged in. This is me, Mr. Ramirez, I'm logged in. I'm gonna come over here. And these are all my folders that I have in Google and all my different files that I have in Google. I'm going to make a new folder and I'll call it graphic design. I created that. So it's going to come up here and here it is graphic designs. I click on it. There's nothing in there. I'm going to my downloads folder. I'm going to grab my zero one lines and drop it in there, and it now transfers all of the files over into Google, and it's nicely organized. I have my graphic design, I have my first project, and we're done.